we rescued the dragon from Hauntel Hall. Okay, I was just on my phone, you know, just doing some stuff. And then <laughs> And then I, I got a message from Nati. I got a message from Nati. Where is she at? Uh baby, where you at? Bibs? Where is she at? Oh, she's right here. She said my my mother would like to speak with me. I believe she learned about what we've been up to. Uh, she's hoping that it will, her mom might go easier on her if we're there. And then I started the video while Popping was like, uh, Popping said, you know, can we meet at the three broomsticks? Let's finally be safe. We rescued the dragon from Hornetail. All right. Well, I mean, <laughs> dang, I kind of wanted to go use the bathroom and drink some water, but it seems like we're just doing. Okay, so is this I want to do Professor Weasling's mission right now. Oh, that's the main mission to do anyways. I do want to learn this spell just so I can get it out the way. So collect the field pack gauge. And okay, so let's go ahead and do that first. Guys, we're level 33. We are leveling up fast oh this is here collect the field page in the underground harbor underground harbor What? Oh, hello. What the? You can't enter while mounted. What the heck is this? Professor Weasley, what? Rebellion. Is that a chest with an eyeball? Yeah, it is. Rebellion. Ah, it's over there. Okay. Is that another one? So this is the underground harbor. Rebellion. <laughs> the hell? Oh. Why is this ghost crying? Why are you crying? <laughs> okay, bye. The heck? Via the courtyard. What? Was this always here? <laughs> we look like Morpheus. I don't know why, but we look like Morpheus for some reason. Wait, where is this? What the? Rebellion. Where are we? Oh, I know where we are. That's crazy. Hmm. Collect the field package from the book on intermediate transforming in the library. Okay. Is it this chest? So something is pinging. I think it's up here. If I remember correctly, if I remember correctly, there's a lot of stuff in Hogwarts that we haven't discovered yet. Back, back, Rebellion. I've no time for idle chatter. Oh. 
portrait of Sir Cardogan. Alleged friends with Merlin himself. Mm. Rebellion. So we have to go in the forbidden section. No. We have to go up. Have we been up here before? Yeah, yeah yes, we have. That book Professor Weasley asked me to find should be around here somewhere. Rebellion. Looking for the book Intermediate Transfiguration. Um, yes. Professor Weasley asked me to, uh, get something from that book. May I have it? Did she now? Oh my god. I'll give you this book if you humor me by answering a few questions from my quiz. I hate quiz. you. Some people call bits of knowledge trivia. I would argue that no knowledge is trivial. Hence, I have created a small quiz, just for fun, focusing mainly on the lore of the wizarding world. None of the other students will try it, no matter how many times I ask. They all say they have enough with schoolwork. Oh, they don't value knowledge the way I do. Surely you're interested. I'll even start you off with a few of my easiest questions. I, I, I think it's because you're annoying, but let's do it. A quiz sounds like fun. Splendid. Just a few questions, and then I'll hand over this book. Let us begin. Before the invention of the Golden Snitch, which magical creature was used in the game of Quidditch? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> the Golden Snuggery does... Mm. Mm. The Golden Snidget. Correct! The Snidget was first introduced to Quidditch in 1269 by a wizard named Barbarous Bragg. Sadly, they're thought to be extinct. Next question. Which potion is commonly referred to as liquid luck? The pepper up potion. I'm afraid the answer was Felix Felicis. Hmm. Since it makes the drinker temporarily lucky, Felix Felicis is a banned substance in all organized competitions. Hmm. The tale of the three brothers involves which magical artifacts? Ooh. Oh, hold on. The founder's relics. I remember this. I, I remember this from Harry Potter. Um, the hero cricks. I think it's the founder's relics. The Founders' Relics. No. The, the Deathly Hallows. It was the other one of those two. The, Bard, the Elder Wand, the, the Stone, and the Cloak of Invisibility. The yeah. The Resurrection Stone and the Cloak of Invisibility. Which ball in Quidditch is the largest? The Snitch. The Quaffle. That's right. When a chaser throws the Quaffle through one of three hoops in a Quidditch match, their team. I need to get three right, points. right? True or false? Polyjuice potion allows a drinker to change species. Poly, I don't. Polyjuice, I guess. Poly means polymorph. True. Actually, oh my the God. answer was false. <laughs> One polyjuice potion can be used to change things such as age or race. It cannot be used to change species. Well, I suppose this has gone on long enough. I'll put the book back on the pedestal now. If you're inclined to test your knowledge again, I have plenty more questions I could ask you. And I won't be giving you any more easy questions either. The next ones will be more difficult. I bet you... I, I'm sorry. I don't have time for a quiz at the moment. Let me know if you change your mind. I bet you there is a trophy or I something. I put the book back on the pedestal for you. Rebellion Re Re to make quick luck of this. That's the Weasley's tasks are complete. Want to... I'd like to answer more questions. What governmental body directly preceded the Ministry of Magic? The Wizards Council. That's correct. The Wizards Council dispa- Which dragon breed is the smallest? I 
I don't know. Iron Belly? The Ukrainian Iron Belly. No, I'm sorry. Though the Viper Tooth is a small, who founded the village of Hogsmeade? Quincy Hog. No. Wow. The answer was Hengist of Woodcroft. The hide behind was accidentally created by. Cro the hide behind was actually created by crossbreeding a ghoul. Oh, uh, damn you guys. A letherfold. That's incorrect. Oh my god, I said it, but I chose something the else. Vine has the power of uh. What is the only spell known to repel a letherfold? I don't know. I don't know. The Patronus charm. Well done. The only known survivor of it. Who published the law of elemental transfiguration? I don't know. I don't know. Laverne de Montmorency. That's incorrect. One of the principal exceptions to Gamp's law is that food cannot be conjured. The, what does the Hogwarts motto translate to? Knowledge is the real magic. No. Yours, <laughs> never. In Latin, the Hogwarts motto is Draco, which magical creature is the only one known to produce eggs through its mouth? What? The Ashwander, the Basilisk, the, the Basilisk? The Basilisk. That's Oh correct. my god. The correct, according to Parcel Man. I don't know. These questions where are. Where is Ilvermorny School of Witchcraft and Wizardry located? I don't know. The Amazon for Rainforest? That sounds like something in the mountain? Mount Greylock? I don't know. The Pyrenees. The American School was founded in the 17th century. What is the most powerful love potion known to wizard kind? Elixir moves from the shop. to serum. Incorrect. Oh my god. Dude, I'm dumb as hell, just so y'all know. Differently to every Are you interested in continuing no. on to the next? No. I don't have time for another quiz. That's I suck. Like, I literally have to look online the answer for all of her freaking things, man. <laughs> wow, I suck. Anyways, the class is up here, right? Let's fast travel. Wow. Wow. I got so many questions incorrect. I have never gotten a big fat F in my life before. I swear to God. In school, I've never gotten Fs, man. Just. Oh. So frustrating. I did not. Oh, this is her mom. Hey, bye. I didn't mean to. Bye. <laughs> I didn't know that that was her mom. Yeah, Nazi, you're on your own, babe. I didn't mean to go to that quest right now. I meant to go to Professor Weasley. <laughs> Oops. Oops. My fizzing whiz beer is still brewing. These things take time. I heard Professor Weasley transfigured the book with all her test answers. Into Hello, Gareth. So, has your aunt been taking it a bit easier on you lately? Unfortunately, no. In fact, a few days ago, she gave me a detention. I was only testing a new recipe in a mostly empty classroom, and the fire was put out. Mostly quick empty classroom. You don't create anything worthwhile without setting a few things on fire. Agreed. Innovators like us are unappreciated in our time. Can't let the doubters sway me. When they taste my latest brew, they'll forget their criticisms and the fires. It'll be bigger than butterbeer. Oh, that gives me an idea. Better write it down. Best of luck to you. Wow, thank you, Gareth. Good talk. <laughs> Galleons and a historian's uniform. <sighs> Yo, it's it's been a while since we attended her classroom. Settle down, settle down. Transfiguration, as you may be weary of hearing me say, is an exact science that can take hey, a babe. lifetime to master. But we needn't be daunted. Almost anything can be transformed if you can just perceive the potential within it. 
as I see in all of you. Tremendous witches and wizards, every one of you. Or it could just be my eyesight. Now, you all know what to do. That's pretty cool. Just say you? That's cool. Beautifully done. That was cool. Learn all spells. I guess these don't count as spells. I mean, they're curses, but still. You wanted to discuss my progress so far this term, Professor. I did. You seem to have had no trouble in getting up to speed. And frankly, excelling in your schoolwork this year. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Professor. The extra assignments have been helpful. As I suspected they would be. Now, it seems you've been making excellent use of the opportunities presented by your field guide. Of course, the guide isn't the only measure of success. Deke tells me you captured a unicorn oh. and brought it back to the room of requirement. Yes, I have. Protecting so rare a beast is an accomplishment of which you can be quite proud. Thank you, Professor. I will say I'm especially impressed with all you've accomplished in light of the rumors of your extracurricular activities. <laughs> Was your visit to an ex-aura in Upper Hogsfield connected in any way to Professor Fig? I can't begin to imagine what So that's tell her the truth? <sighs> yeah. Professor Fig has encouraged me to explore when I can in uh, an effort to complete my field guide. I see. I admire your penchant for learning, but do remember that your classwork and field guide are designed to educate you thoroughly. It'll be the end of the year in no time, and you'll want to be well prepared for your OWLs. I'll provide a final assessment at that time to ensure that you're ready for your exams. Yes, ma'am. Until then, well done. You are dismissed. Thank you. All right. Class assignment six of six. Oh, I guess I got to mess with the spell real quick. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. You know what? Maybe I'll keep that instead of the ice spell. Maybe. Since our visit to Feldcroft, something dawned on me about the triptych. Meet me at the Overlook, just north of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll explain. Sebastian, come on, bro. My plan with the helmet failed, but I have another idea. I think we may be able to find what we need at a goblin mine south of Hogwarts. Meet me there and bring someone who speaks goblin. Book. I know someone who speaks gobbledygook. Oh, God. Question is, will they help us? Wait a minute, what the hell is a book flying over there? Where, where's that secret? Oh, I was like, where's this area at that has a flying book and all these things that I haven't discovered yet? Oh, yo, there's a lot of stuff here. What the? Rebellion. Levioso. Rebellion. So 
That's all that's here. There's a flying book in here. Revelio. I know where this butterfly goes. Rebellion. No, it's hold on. What the Hold on, hold on, hold on, bro. There's so much hold on. There's so much happening right now in this one more. area that I just unlocked. Hold on. Let me take it one step at a time. Rebellion. Seems like these are rooms that used to belong to professors. What is this ancient Egypt section of Hogwarts? What the hell is going on here? Oh my god, another challenge area? Oh my god. Rebellion. So this butterfly thing is it's up here Lumos. <laughs> Twins. Revelio. Okay, it's bringing me. Okay, 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 okay. Hold on. There's so much happening right now. These are the two main missions. Uh, let's go talk to her and her mom first. But before we do that, let's check out everything. So these are done. Almost done with the main. Almost done. Actually, we're nowhere near done with the side quests. Collection. What do we have? A couple cloaks. Oh, hold on. That one looks nice. We collected a bunch of field guide books, pages. Uh, inventory. We picked up some notes. I think we're OK. No, we're good. I was going to say, I think we're maxed out on gear, but we're good. Okay. Let's go speak to Nazi. Should I change up my cloak? I just unlocked. Was it this one? No. I think it was this one. 
Yeah, this looks cool. This actually looks pretty cool. Versus this one. Let's rock this one for a little bit. Does it just change the stuff I'm wearing under? Yeah. So I guess. The high socks or. Yes, yeah, looks, I mean, it's fine. Okay, I'll put this back on. Can we have a scarf? We can. Is there a black one? Maybe some type of blue. No, that's kind of purplish. This is not the right blue. That's not the right blue. Maybe something black. No, that's a little bit too much. This is perfect. Yeah, let's leave this one on. Now nah, let's leave this on. Maybe change his gloves too. Every hat looks stupid, so I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna look at a hat right now. Alright, I think we'll rock him like this for the next couple episodes. Alright, so Nazi. Nazi 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 Nazi. Okay, so she's up here. It's crazy because I didn't even think to think that that was her mom. So let's see. Hey, Nazi's mom. So frustrating. You wanted to speak with me, mother? I had hoped to speak with you alone, Natsai. Oh, your Natsai. You mentioned your concern about an unusual creature that was spotted in the woods near Hogsmeade. That could have been anything. You know what it was, Natsai. I am allowed to leave the castle. I am always careful, mother. Careful? Officer Singer disagrees. She sent me an owl telling me that you have been trying to collect evidence of some kind against dark wizards. Uh oh. She berated me for not keeping a closer eye on you. And she is right. I do not want you visiting Hogsmeade for the near future. Oh, but shit. Mama, my little gazelle, you are well intentioned, but you must not meddle in the affairs of dangerous people. If someone had meddled in Matabilaland, father would still be with us. Uh oh. I must get to class. Perhaps your friend can get you to listen to reason. Mm -mm. So frustrating. She never listens to me. She called you her little gazelle. Is that a term of endearment where you're from? It is specific to me. <sighs> I am the unusual creature in Hogsmeade she mentioned. <laughs> Self-transfiguration is not taught at Hogwarts. So I am gently discouraged from practicing it. 
However, I am an Anamagus, and it is in my gazelle form that I have been able to wander the highlands rather freely until now. Oh shit! Much to my mother's chagrin. I want to transform. Is how I managed to spy on Rookwood and Harlow. I want to transform. Wow! What? Can I transform? Were you born an Anamagus, or did you learn to become one? Anamagi are not born. The process is quite elaborate. It involves holding a mandrake leaf in one's mouth for an entire month, then placing the leaf in a crystal file so that it is imbued with moonlight, then adding one of your own hairs. Okay. And that is just the beginning. Self-transfiguration is common among students at Wagadu. Okay. But Professor Weasley considers it much too dangerous to teach uh, at Professor Hogwarts. Weasley, you ass. Dude. Uh. Can you choose what form your Animagus will take? Oh, no. A person's Animagus form is determined by their personality. Oh, shit. My mother is convinced that my form is a gazelle because I adapt well to any situation. I believe it is because I can sense danger and keep my wits about me. Oh, dude, what would be my form? A fucking gorilla? How does it feel to transform into an animal? Well, the first time, it can be a bit unnerving. I felt a kind of searing pain and a strong double heartbeat. But it gets easier the more you do it. I no longer feel any pain, and I must say, I find a sense of comfort in the double heartbeat. I And I love being able to view the world from a different perspective. What if she gets shot and killed or mauled? By what the dragon? Mm, that's... Now the nickname makes sense. What an extraordinary ability to have! It is. I love transforming, but Mother is less enthusiastic about it. She says that no creature, especially one as rare as a gazelle, should be bounding about where poaching has become so prevalent. That makes sense. <sighs> she claims that she has foreseen tragedy befall me in my gazelle form. But she has used her sight to control me too many times. I no longer believe it. I mean, uh, I mean, she's concerned. If, if your mom is a seer, be careful. It may be she best might be for right. You to stay away from Hogsmeade for now. That may be safe, but I do not believe that it would be best. Do you? You could have fled the moment you discovered that Rookwood, Harlow, and Randrock were after you, but you did not. I choose to act as you have. Oh shit. I must deal with Rookwood. Don't blame me. She's blaming me. <sighs> My mother cannot know where I am all the time. She's blaming me. So she's Anne is getting worse. If there is any chance that the relic from Slytherin's spellbook can help her, I must find it. I'm requesting your help. Meet me outside of Feldcroft, near the catacomb. So Nazi's blaming me. She says, you know, you didn't run away. So I'm only acting as you have. No, Nazi. No, 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 no. Don't, don't, don't blame me. Yo. She's over here blaming me. What the hell? Okay, so. Um, I was going to do something else besides Poppy, but is Poppy up here? Oh no, a, a meat is in the class over there. Oh no, I was gonna take off this marker. Okay. Dude, why is Poppy always in like the random areas? Like, what is she doing? Where's she at? She's in three broomsticks? Okay. Oh, another mission. Are these missions to talk to people or just simply just talking to them? So it's they're real easy and what quick to do. To now? So let's just do that and then. Over here. What are you drinking? This is a change of pace from our last outing. Don't remind me. The thought of that tent still makes my blood boil. I've been thinking about those poor dragons in the fighting ring. The collars they were wearing, they appeared to be goblin silver. I think a collar is precisely what we found at that poacher camp. I've never known poachers to use anything like that before. The dragon that attacked my carriage was wearing a collar, and Professor Fig was genuinely baffled by its behavior. That attack always did strike me as a little strange, seemingly coming out of nowhere. Hmm. Surely you aren't suggesting that the collars somehow control the poor creatures? Of course. Exactly. Merlin, 
I don't think the dragon we set free. My name is, is Senpai, color, not Merlin. We should check. And if we can find her, we can return her egg. That's a good idea. We need to see this through. I'll start looking into it right away. There was something else that I wanted to discuss with you. I didn't want to press it before. It seems I may have caused you more trouble with Victor Rookwood. Why is he after you? I mean, I'll tell her the truth. Rookwood is working with Ranrock, and Ranrock is after something I found at Gringotts. Fig had a porky that led us there after the dragon attack. It's a bit of a long story, and Fig had asked that I not speak of it yet. Goodness. Well, that certainly helps to shed light on what we saw at the tent. Don't worry, I'll guard your secret as if it were my own. I shan't press for more details. In fact, I should probably be going. I'd like to track that dragon down as soon as I can. Hmm. I'll let you know when I have news of her location. All right. Yo, the women who, wait, what? Who, what? There's a store here? No, there's not. Are you the storekeeper? Has there always been a store in Hogsmeade? No, there's yeah, I can't buy anything from three broomsticks. That's weird. All right, let's just um, talk to Sebastian real quick. Meet him in the catacombs. What the hell are you, bro? What the what the? Oh, this is his town. Okay. So he's in the next town. Mysterious and a bit unsettling. What to do? Wait, what are these enemies real quick? Spiders? Ugh, fine. Launch a transformed enemy with the pulse. Uh, okay, hold on. I'm just collecting these. Sebastian, thank you for helping me. You asshole. <laughs> Alright. What's up, bro? You're here. Yes. Good. Uh okay. Sebastian, that relic you mentioned. I believe one of Slytherin's students stumbled upon the relic during an assignment to study sarcophagi in this catacomb. From what I read in a report by the student, sarcophagi they permitted to take it with them. So I must assume it's still here. As I mentioned earlier, this relic grants its holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. If it's in this catacomb, I have to find it. For Anne. I need to see her. I'd be interested to know what else the student discovered. Have a look. Unfortunately, there's no name on it. But I suspect if it was important enough for Slytherin to stash in his spellbook, it's worthy of further study. Hmm. I'm ready to explore the catacomb. Perhaps we can visit Anne when we finished. Perfect. By the way, Ominous has been asking about you. You didn't tell him what we were doing, did you? I didn't. I promise. Good. Ominous would be livid if he knew what we were about to do. <sighs> That's true. Oh my god. Okay. I'll be interested to compare what lies inside to what I've read about this catacomb. I guess we'll do that now. Might, I mean, might as well. Oh god. It's gonna be spiders. 
It's always spiders, bro. Lumos. I'm sure that foul smell is the scent of success. Try not to lose your nerve just yet. All right, let's go. Let's go, brother. Revelio. Lumos. Oh my Lumos. God! I fucking. At least now we know we're not alone in here. Perhaps that was it. And the rest is insect free. No. Yeah, spiders aren't insects. Don't start. Accio. Confringo. Accio. We're here for a reason. Yeah. I'd say open the is justified. Revelio. This room is taller than it looks. Oh, so I need a uh, come here. Accio. Leviosa. Finding a chest. Rebellion. Conspicuous loft. Brilliant. Wait, did I pick this chest up already? Oh. Oh, potions. Lumos. Revelio. God damn it, bro. Keep Why? I don't understand this. Oh, freeze him, freeze him. I'm stupid. Freeze, 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 freeze. Um, 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 um. Wait, wouldn't that work? No, not freeze. I'm so stupid. Slow. Slow, baby. Slow. There you go. Sebastian! <laughs> Sebastian, you asshole. Okay. Okay. We've read the world of another spider. Okay. I shall sleep better tonight. Sebastian, you're an ass. But I get it. I get it. Slow them. Lift and then slow. Revelio. Lift and then slow. Okay. Confringo. Revelio. Okay, let me pull these out. Spiders. Rebellion. Okay, we do gotta go that way, but let's go this way first. Lines, spiders. I need to slip there. Feels like a tomb. I've read about catacombs that underwent expansion efforts and ran into problems, often cave ins, and then were abandoned. Exactly. We'll be fine though. Oh, Seb Sebastian, dude. He's like being so negative, bro. Like, calm down. Let's just explore the cave. Whatever happens, happens, bro. Lumos. Lumos. He's like being so negative, saying, "Yeah, you know, there were cavens, but everything was fine, though." Like, dude. Now this is the sort of great room I want to be buried in, surrounded by grandeur. Oh, grandeur and then spiders. some. Even an altar with a pile of bones. Mm. Lovely. Bones outside a sarcophagus. Seems odd. Rebellion. We're in a tomb. I assume eerie sounds come in the territory. Ah, 
here. I think we need these bones. There's something here by the altar. There's a spider in one of these. And here's a spider. Revelio. Oh no, it's back here. Akio. Damage of frozen enemy. Lumos. That, that spider almost whacked my ass. Revelio. For right now, let's just gather all the bones. Revelio. We can't go back there yet. Uh, the pulso. Yeah, this requires the bones. Okay. Revelio. Okay, I already went over there, so let's go this way. Let me see what's over here. We've made it this far, but clearly we have more to do. And then Okay. Am I going the right way by any chance, guys? Or oh, okay. So this leads me back around. Good. Akio. Opens that gate. Okay. Rebellion. Okay. Akio. Rebellion. There's something up. We're probably gonna get that way through here. Okay. What did you find? I found bones, more and more and more bones. Dude, is he not watching me do Looks any of this? Like part of a student's diary. It mentions plans to return for the relic and conjuring barricades using bones. Of course. The student's summary referenced the space beyond the great room, which means this can't be a dead end. Let's divide and conquer. You work on sorting out the bone barricades. I'll look around and see what we missed. <laughs> Dude, I already did. that diary entry? There may be more to it. It does mention something else. It says their next assignment was learning the Imperius curse. Really? 
Interesting. We need to focus on moving beyond this room. But let me think for a moment. But I already did everything. Of course. I'll start to search for those barricades. Brilliant. I already did everything. I, it, There's more to this than even I imagined. I, I already... Oh, yeah. I was going to say. Lumos. Lumos. Oh, fucking spiders. Bring it on. Before we trudge on further, I've just realized something. The student's diary mentions the Imperious Curse. I wouldn't be surprised if we're going to need it here. It's an unforgivable, but useful when you're outnumbered. Places the victim completely under the caster's control. I love so, it. So, if you'd like to learn Imperial, yes. I can teach you. Yes, now. I prefer not to learn Imperial. Yes, I would like to learn. How do you know? Still teach me. It's probably wise to know the spell. I couldn't agree more. A spell that could save your life shouldn't be unforgivable. You have a lot at stake. You have an ability that evidently no one's seen for centuries. I think someone was telling me, probably my Focus friend. Focus your wand movement. It's not an easy spell to master. No, I saw it on. Um, I saw it on YouTube that there's multiple endings to this game. Like what? I'm like multiple endings. Why couldn't? Here we go. Something troubling ahead. Yeah, spiders. Be on your guard. Hold on. I wanted to add these spells over here, so I guess now is the time. Oops. We'll keep this one as ice. Um. What did I just do? Look at this. Dude, defeat your spider friend. Come on. Oh, nice. So now what? Oh. Okay. Another barricade. Considering how well you did on the last one, this should be a cinch. <laughs> how gracious! Ah, uh, spiders over there. I try. That's a big ass one. Fuck. Yo, Sebastian, let's go. Come on, Sebastian, let's go. Oh my god. Oh, frames, frames. My frames are dropping. What the hell was that? Yes, spider. Yes. Kill your offsprings. Yes, spiders. Kill your offspring. Do it. Do it. No. Cast it. Should have been the bigger one, but... Spell, I actually like that spell. I'm not gonna lie, that's pretty. Can you burn the can you burn the webs? Okay. Alright, so 
Let's see what's in here. Spiders? No, rats. Big ass rats. This catacomb has suffered decay. Just as the student summary described, I doubt anyone's been here in quite some time. Okay, let's go to the other side. Ah, uh, we we just broke a vase. <laughs> Rebellion. Sebastian's with me. I got my boy with me, so it's okay. Lumos. Um, that's the skeleton bridge that I built. Okay, cool. That just scared me, bro. And what's crazy is I plan on playing scary games on this channel. So if you guys want to see me shit myself, stay tuned. Okay, so we can't go here yet. All right, so let's figure this out. Lumos. There's a spider behind um, one of these. I think it's Keep going. Oh, I have to go in order. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was not paying attention. Okay, this first. My bad. And then this. Okay. Wasn't there a spider behind one of these? I realized once I got to this area, you are head and shoulders above these. The PS5 frame rate just started to just drop. I'm like, whoa! Because I'm playing this game on performance mode. Student was so entranced with this place. Okay, yeah. I'm playing this on performance mode. I have a cooling fan for my PS5 and I have a cooling fan for my uh, for my laptop. So frames shouldn't be dropping as much as they are right now. That's why I'm kind of like having to look over and make sure things are still recording for you guys. Cause that's, that, that's weird. Oh my God, more spiders, dude. All right, let's go. I'm ready. Rebellion. All right, where they at? Is there a big one? No. Hold on, dude. Let me slice them. Oh my lord. Yeah, Sebastian. Good luck. Good luck. Holy shit. Okay, slice of frozen. I want to slice one real quick. Gotta be faster than that. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let, let me wait for for the slice to be back. Okay. Oh, slice hasn't killed him. Eh, it's okay. For a moment there, I thought that'd never end. Why is it always spiders, bro? It's just like it's always spiders. Rebellion. Always, always, everything is spiders. <sighs> Fuck. 
Lumos. Lumos. Anyways, Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Are we are we done? Dead end. Lovely. All that for nothing. Hold on. Don't give up yet. Accio. The only contains both possibly possibly we benefits not only with the crime but the world, but the dark sacrifice and cause realistic intent might be too great. Until we know more, please do not remove this relic. No, it's here. Oh god. Sebastian, the relic! Look. Could it be? I don't think we sh Sebastian. The note and rendition of the relic. It matches. <laughs> This must be where the student left the relic. I can't believe it. After all this, it lines up. We've really found it. What do you suppose is meant by the dark sacrifice required to realize the relic's potential? I have no idea, but we're here for the relic. We should leave the relic alone, bro. Because, dude, you have to sacrifice yourself. The note advises to leave the relic alone. I assure you, we were meant to find this. Mm -mm. For Anne's sake, mm -mm. I'm taking it. Let's get to Feldcroft. Mm -mm. I must keep this relic secret, especially from my uncle. Oh, look who it is. Ominous. Oh, shit. Is that ominous? Mm -mm. Ominous. The sounds we kept hearing. It was you. You gave me no choice. I had to follow you. Sebastian, please, leave the relic alone. We can find another way to help Anne. I'm sorry, Ominous, but I'm taking it. No, you're not. If you won't put it back, then I will. Hold on, both of you. Sebastian, please, take a step back. Fine, but Ominous knows I won't step back from a fight. Can't believe this. Oh, bro, I, I don't think he should take it either, honestly. How much did you hear? Everything. I was glad to hear you tell Sebastian to leave the relic. We need to stand together. Convince Sebastian this is wrong. And if nothing will change his mind? Something has to. I need your help. Very well, let's talk to Sebastian. I cannot side with you. Oh, my God. Why, bro? I don't want to look this up because I, I don't know what's the right choice and what's the wrong choice. I don't want to look this up. Sebastian is doing this for his sister, but I, I'm going to know firsthand what dark arts I mean, We know what well, I know and you guys should know how bad the dark arts magics are because of Harry Potter. <sighs> Very well, let's talk to Sebastian. I cannot side with you. Sebastian's right. I really, I really don't want Sebastian to, cause dude, it requires a dark sacrifice, bro. Nah. You're right. This seems far riskier than Sebastian realizes. Good. We're agreed. We don't allow him to leave here with the relic. Yeah. I do think we should talk to him, but I fear we won't stop him from taking the relic. What are you suggesting? I'm suggesting we negotiate. We allow Sebastian to leave with the relic under one condition. After this, no more. I feel that's what we agreed to in the scriptorium. I'm being taken for a fool. You're not, Ominous. This may be the only way to keep your friendship intact. Let's trust him to know what's best. Fine. If I trust him on this, I'm trusting you too. The dark arts seem harmless until it's too late. That's true. <sighs> Go then. Leave with the relic. I'll not say a word more. Hmm. I hope I don't regret this. Mm. Sebastian, we're ready. Mm. What is it? I haven't changed my mind. Ominous has. Let's go. What? Ominous? I'll explain on the way. Come on. Sebastian's gonna probably be like, why didn't you side with me? Blah, blah, blah. But it's like, bro, you don't know what you're getting into, man. I mean, I would love to. Oh. I would love to, you well, know. What happened back then? Ominous and I found a compromise. Ominous simply needs a moment with you and he'll change his mind. Is that it? I told him we ought to give you this chance. That the relic is too important to ignore. 
There has to be more to it than that. Tell me. We agreed on what was needed, Sebastian. You have my word. Dude, what? You're not gonna tell him that this was the last he one? He never wanted to keep all this from Ominous. He just doesn't understand. And I did want to worry him all over again. You're not gonna tell him about the one condition that this is the last one? Oh, bro. Okay. 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 <laughs> As we were leaving, Ominous wouldn't even acknowledge me. That's not like him. He was troubled, Sebastian. Even though we agreed to it all, it's been a lot to take in. I thought he understood. He knew we couldn't give up. All of this is too important for Anne. We gotta return to... Okay, so let's save that for another episode. We did a lot in this episode, and I mean a lot. So it seems like we have to return and then to check on Anne. So that's probably gonna be like a whole another 20, 30 minutes. So we'll do that later, guys. Let's go ahead and save it right here. Um, thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. When we come back, I have no idea what's gonna happen, but let's see. All right.